My name is Jen. I live in uh, Bethlehem, which is located on the east coast of Pennsylvania. I've been a cyclist for well over 20 years and I've always wanted to customize my own bike frame. I've also been itching to learn how to hydrate lately, so I decided as a spring project that I would combine both of them and build my own bike. So I was able to score this sweet chonky frame that is made by Kona Bicycles. But in order for me to dip this frame and have my colors uh, on my film show up, unfortunately I'm gonna have to paint it white. I really wanted to keep some of this sweet gold color, uh, so I painstakingly masked all of the lettering areas. Uh, so after it is painted, uh, primed, and dipped, I'll pull this off and then hopefully uh, the gold color will shine through without a whole lot of touch up. First thing that I needed to do was to actually learn about the process of hydro dipping. I knew zero zip, nada about any of it. So after watching a whole bunch of videos and research uh, myself, I dove 1000% into trying to figure out how to do this. So for those of you who don't know what hydro dipping is, I give you a real quick and dirty explanation. It is actually a special ink that is printed in a pattern on a water soluble film that is made from the same materials that the Tide Pods are made out of. So please do not eat these either. What you do then is you lay your film on top of your water and it absorbs, uh, the film absorbs the water and then you spray it with an activator. The activator liquefies the ink and dissolves the film so as you push the object into the water, the pattern wraps and adheres to the surface. Seems pretty simple, right? Wrong. Each film is a different animal. I practiced on 14 designs. Some activation times were more difficult to figure out uh, than others, and some films actually reacted better with a different activator. Uh, and well, then there's just me. Before I even paint the frame, I need to scuff up the shine. Uh, so in order to do that, I'm going to wet sand it. I'm excited to get started, so here I go. 